Chemlink provides an extensive line of adhesives, sealants, systems, and accessories used throughout the building envelope and adjoining surfaces. These products are used for both new construction and repair and maintenance. Chemlink has been in business for 25 years. We have 90 employees and we experienced 20% average annual growth over the past five years. We have over 38 million pounds of annual production capacity for ISO 9001 2008 certified and we're an approved tier two automotive supplier. There are specifications available to install Chemlink E-Curbs on any granulated modified bitumen, built-up roofing system, PVC, EPDM, KEE, and TPO single-ply membranes, although a TPO primer is required when binding E-Curbs to a TPO membrane. Round E-Curbs are available in 3-inch, 4-inch, 6-inch, and 9-inch diameters. The proper size E-Curb has a 1-inch space between the roof penetration and the inside wall of the curb. All rust, loose paint, roof cement, and other contaminants need to be removed as best as possible before the e-curb can be installed. If an e-curb cannot be slipped over the pipe in one piece, tracing the outline of the roof surface with a magic marker on each section can help position the curb parts during assembly. This is especially true for oval or rectangular shaped e-curbs. After you determine the proper size curb to be used, seal the base of the penetration and prime the penetration with M1 structural sealant. This prevents the one part portable sealer from leaking into the roof and provides for a tighter bond onto the roof penetration. The M1 shell extend up the penetration three inches, which is one inch higher than the top of the E-curb. This allows inspectors to see that the roof penetrations were primed with the M1. A quarter inch bead of M1 structural sealant is applied to the entire bottom perimeter and another bead down the middle of each curb section. After the M1 has been applied to the bottoms of the curb sections, position the curb in place and press it down firmly onto the roof flattening out the M1 under the flange of the E-curb. Apply an additional bead of M1 around the outside base perimeter and to the slip joints and tool the bead smooth. Then fill the entire E-curb with one part portable sealer. Do not fill the bottom of the E-curb with grout, granules, roof cement, or insulation to take up volume. This will avoid the E-curb warranty. One part portable sealer is immediately watertight after pouring and it skins over in about 20 minutes at 70 degrees Fahrenheit and 50% relative humidity. E-curbs can be installed on any type of commercial single-ply roof system. These include granulated SBS and APP modified bitumen, smooth and gravel surface BUR, EPDM, PVC, KEE, and TPO. However, TPO needs to be primed with a TPO primer before installation. Round E-curbs are available in three inch, 4-inch, 6-inch, and 9-inch diameters. 2-inch corners and 3-inch and 8-inch straight sections are also available to make rectangular or oval-shaped E-curbs. E-curbs are bonded to the roofs and made watertight with M1 structural sealant and one part portable sealer. Both of these products are totally solvent-free and totally odorless and cannot shrink. One part portable sealer is 100% solid free and cannot shrink. The cured rubber is very flexible and can accommodate roof movement. It saves labor costs associated with mixing and human errors and concerns are eliminated. It eliminates waste because unused portions of the foil pouches or the tubes and cartridges can be sealed and used on the next job. It's immediately watertight even though it's been freshly poured and it does skin over in about 20 minutes. A completed E-curb provides four redundant watertight seals. The M1 seal around the base of the roof penetration, the cured two inch thick rubber plug of one part portable sealer inside the curb form, the M1 seal under each M-curb section, the M-curb seal around the entire outside base perimeter of the E-curb 